Welcome back to Sonic Adventure Director's Cut Action Replay. Welcome back to Sadzar. There we go. I think that should be the, the key point in introducing this. What do you think? Yeah, Sadzar. You know, I've always wondered, does Sonic always introduce himself as I'm Sonic, Sonic the Hedgehog? Well, I mean, sure. It's like, I'm Sonic. What? What? Who Who the hell? Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh, right, right. Like, I thought he was going for a James Bond thing. Like, he always goes Bond, James Bond. But now we got Sonic, it's Sonic the Hedgehog. I think it's more of a platypus. Ah, parody platypus. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Maybe it's different for animals. I'm sorry for assuming. It's okay. Just check your privilege next time. <laughs> <laughs> check your privilege on animal introductions. All right, let's head back to Station Square. <laughs> Just check your that's the silliest thing I've heard today. <laughs> Check your privileges on introducing animals, please. With the proper titles and everything. Alright, so we gotta go get an item, a power-up for Sonic, and an optional one that will make things easier. And then we gotta go to the casino and do some pinball shit. Oh, some Sonic pinball shit. Ah, oh, lovely. The casino's open at night, so this means we gotta do something before it gets dark. I notice how it's gradually turning into night. That was also in the original. It's nuts. Yeah, and Sonic wouldn't have a day-night cycle again until Sonic Frontiers. How about that? That's crazy, but I know I know we're hitting flags in order to change the time of day. But that's still so interesting. But still, man. Yeah. Alright, we got shoes now. You know, I was almost about to correct you about the day-night thing, and then I remembered you could force well, the day and night in nice Sonic Unleashed, and it was Press awful. Oh, oh, that was a different Sonic. Yeah. But it was different, because yeah, it wasn't power, natural. It was, the you know, hit the, hit the, the, the time the hourglass, like, and it changes the night. Like, do you want to have a crazy Unleashed boost as as gameplay, or do you want it to be a mediocre third-person uh, action platform? Whoa! Right! Lightspeed dash! I miss a lightspeed dash. You can tell how old this is because uh, this is the only game, I think, where you have to actually charge for it. From this point forward, instantaneous. Maybe that was just a quality of life thing. I think that was... yeah, that, 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 I think so. Yeah, because he basically envelops the light energy around him. He's just like, I'm ready to light speed dash! But now he just uses the energy of the rings to go... Vroom! Which is nice. It always feels good when you can pop off like that. What is nice is that immediately when you uh, get this item, you can get a power-up for it. Try and see if I can kind of force my way through, yeah, but through a little bit. They are they are very stingy with their uh, with their invisible walls in this game. You're gonna find out. Maybe maybe I can make a cool jump over here and try. Oh no, I think there's a. Are you kidding me? Kind of, are you wow, serious? They are really? stingy. Really? I didn't think they were this stingy because when you went to a to an action level, you kind of just flew wherever you wanted. They don't want me to break the game, but they want me to hit those kill planes. That's what I'm getting from this. Alright. Oh, oh, wait a little bit one more time and go. Woohoo! That easy. Got the ring here. I forget what this does. This this uh, makes the charge up time shorter. Oh, perfect. This is the crystal. And this is the missable one? This reduces the well, time. Well, yeah, because you need light speed dash in order to advance the game, dash. that makes sense. I wouldn't say missable, it's just optional. Okay. Way better! Yeah, much better. Can't imagine playing the game otherwise. Most likely I asked this during the first series, but uh, how long did it take you to actually find everything as a kid? I don't think I ever found any everything as a kid. Oh, wow. So we're gonna hit 100% with this series, that's why. Yeah! Alright, let's see if you can hit that. There we go! I, I think there was a glitch in the matrix there for... Whoa! I don't know if it was the capture or if it just had to hiccup because I skipped a couple of stages to get here, but... Exactly, yeah, you, you sequence broke, my dude. Alright, so I'm thinking, alright, this is, this is gonna be easy. Uh, ordinary, you, get, you gotta get 400 rings to empty in the vault so you can reach the uh, the emerald, but again, those damn invisible walls... Oh, they actually thought of they it! They thought of that! It's completely oh, surrounding! I oh, man! Ridiculous. Oh, man! Alright, plan B. What if I just have to get some rings that unlocks the, the arms that shake me? That makes sense. Maybe that could unlock it. Yeah, Let's yeah. see. Yeah, that makes sense. Release Sonic Shackles. Bring it! La -la -la -la. I don't think that was quite enough. As you can see, they're still very stingy about Damn. that. 
Ugh. Ah. Alright, I guess we're gonna have to do some pinball then. Alright, let's do some hyper fast pinball. Let's we'll start with the Sonic board. Obviously, we can't do the jump here, but I do believe that turbo kind of works in a certain way. I do think we have unlimited tilt, too. Awesome. So we'll just fuck around and do whatever, I guess. Just oh, the, some... the old designs. Yeah. Oh, I love those old designs. I hate this pinball. These flippers are very Oh, they slow. barely work. Just... I'm noticing it barely works. Wow, I never thought of Sonic being a slow ball. I never thought I would miss the pinball portions in Sonic Frontiers. And then it hit me. Oh wow, this is just like the pinball from Sonic Frontiers. It is. Even with the ball going through the fucking flippers! Okay. Now let's get some mo. What's the timer counting down? Like how much time you have for pinball? Or? I, I got a stopper down there. I think that's a bonus up there. But oh, I, just, okay. I just can't get the power! There we go. Knuckles! Hey. Yes! It's a shame Knuckles doesn't have his cowboy hat. That's like, that's almost like Bart's blue shirt. There's some deep lore stuff we need to go into. Y yeah. Ah, uh, ridiculous. I like, I like just like the, the whole console rumbling when that happens. Like, mm -hmm. It's like, just like, no! No! He actually has a crisis when he loses all of his money. By the way, spot-on representation of how casinos work when you drop off your rings and they literally just pick you up and shake your money out of you. House always wins, baby. House uh, always wins. Yeah. no! Okay. Ridiculous. You've got to be kidding me. What? Oh, I don't know what we did, but it's working. Yeah, it worked. I mean, I, it's not like... Oh, oh. And even more, okay. Maybe I'm in the minority, but I have never thought that, you know, Sonic with a pinball worked properly ever. Especially in Frontiers, especially what I'm seeing now. Like, you'd, you'd think it makes sense. It was a thing that they've started to do since, uh... Golly, since the first game, I think, with that casino level. Yeah. I mean, makes sense in context, absolutely. And there we go. Boom, just yeah. dynamite. We got but, over 100 rings, though, so we're still dropped back out here. Maybe this is enough rings. Let me in. What? What? That, what? that I could cheat the system. You almost did. I, I felt like I almost did, but I think it, it was me hitting the visible wall and the camera just kind of following Maybe me. right in the doorway? Oh, right in the doorway, but I think there's a dome protecting the ah. fucking emerald. But, but, Damn it. I know, I know, I know, I know. And it only goes away when you have 400 rings. Right? Maybe. Okay. Oh, You've got to be oh. kidding me. Oh! Tails, help. Pain. Pain. Help a brother out. I feel like if I, if I, uh, go out too far, like, if I were to go out from outside and yeah, try to get in there. Yeah, try to dive in. I would just fall through and then, and then die. Okay, there's collision up here. That's strange. I admit, I admit, this is mostly where Knuckles is supposed to be when he's in this stage. But right. Maybe we can do some fun stuff here. Never saw that Sonic Adventure low-res texture on the screens before, didn't you? Oh! Didn't even know there was a Jumbotron up here. Oh, what? Oh, wait, right, wait. We're out. Wait. We're out. Wait. Oh, we're in. Shit. Uh, okay, right, try again. We have a way to get out. All right. We got, got something. Doing okay. Yeah. <laughs> this is like an ocean's plot. It's time to escape the ja <laughs> escape the jackpot. Wait for it. Okay. Right. Okay. okay. We're out. We're out. out. What is that green square? Yeah, I'm wondering what that is, too. Okay. Ah. So what you're trying to do is basically leave orbit and somehow make it over to where the vault is. I don't even know where the vault is in this. Is it like... Yeah, am I even going towards the vault? Where is the vault, anyway? Is it down here? Or... Oh, well... Yeah, so there's... The that's the entrance. Okay. I think we're just gonna have to play some more pinball. I'm down for it. We'll go to the night stage now. Ah, I hate pinball. <laughs> so, so control-wise, since you are well-versed in Sonic, what do you think is the worst pinball one? Heroes, this, Frontiers, what do you think? Uh, this, this feels pretty bad only because I'm, I've got uh, cheap action replay codes <laughs> on and I'm not really trying. Frontiers was irritating, but not nowhere near the worst. I mean, we both did it first try when we did the Let's Play, I, so. I hate that I was able to do it off camera. <laughs> Just immediately get it. It's like, oh my god, dude, I'm so mad. Somehow this felt better on the Dreamcast. 
I don't know. That just might be my bias, you know, speaking. It is very hit or miss when you get a port job. Yeah. But it just feels like I, can't, I just can't hit it hard enough, you know? I am noticing your Sonic is slowing down. I don't. I can't tell if that's the code of the game. Yeah, it, it might be the code because, you know, again, we're going from 0 to 999 as fast as we can. So maybe when I hit that button, it goes to 0 and kills all my momentum. That's very possible. Well, let's see if we can't uh, have any better luck down here. Have to do some more messing around, huh? Drop down into the abyss. I didn't even see those other guys get hit. That was a bomb. Are you... Oh. Clear as all the enemies on screen. All right, is this seriously how you treat patrons of your casino here, guys? Yeah, we throw them into the trash with the other Sonic I games. I was supposed to say. <laughs> Toss them in the garbage, and then they have to fight their way out. Well, I mean, if a, if, a, if a hedgehog and a fox went into a casino, I'd probably throw them in the sewers, too. I mean, this is an establishment. This is a business. This is a business. The house always wins. Never forget, the house always wins. So if it's a hedgehog with shoes, I'd at least, you know, throw him out because of violating the dress code. At least see what he has to say. If he speaks, well, that's, that's even more reason to listen to him. Yes. He might have some ancient wisdom that we don't know about because we constantly throw out hedgehogs with wearing only, uh, shoes. Impart to us your wisdom, Shit. oh blue hedgehog. Oh, chili dogs! Let's see. Toss them out. Add chili dogs to the menu. <laughs> this was our idea. Don't let anybody... Don't tell anybody that we got it from a hedgehog with shoes. You got a gentleman's club where you, know, you, got, you got strippers, you got people oh. drinking whiskey, and they're all... They're all just eating chili dogs. <laughs> <laughs> With a knife and fork. <laughs> ah, yes, the fine dining establishment, known for its chili dogs and its sweet, uh, saras. Woman takes off her top and just lets Whee! it all out, and the guys are just flopping chili sauce off. Ah, oh, she's a living chili dog! Hot, 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 hot! Ooh. Who put habaneros in the sauce? <laughs> ah, burning! It ah. burns! Maybe we should, uh... Have some regulations about that, this kind of thing. I'm glad we were talking about throwing chili on a naked woman and then we were in the shower. It just seems perfect. Because we're all about good, clean humor here. <laughs> Shit, piss fart ass. We all, we all know that none of the Sonic characters are strippers, except for Big. Well, it's got 31 rings out of that. That wasn't exactly as fruitful as I wanted it to be. Maybe that's enough? I don't think that's enough. 196. Nope. You see, it it takes your rings and then it adds and then and then it oh. applies the counter. Whoa! What happened there? I know. I'm thinking that is is it like a pocket up here that can reach? Are oh. we in? Are oh. we in? Are we in? Holy crap! Oh no, we're not. Oh, we're not in. You had the idea though. Yeah. It's all right. there. All right. Let's let's uh, go down this path a little bit more. We all are right. running out of time. There's no time. Oh, it's not the normal nine minutes. And, uh, 59 seconds? No. Oh. 128 bits, baby! Oh, that's right! Uh, Why the hell did Mania bring that back? Because it's the old school songs, because they couldn't put ten... They, they couldn't put those many integers on a screen at one time. Yes. Wow, that was... Bullshit. That was expert gameplay? Thank you, I know it was. Oh, yes, right, thank you, right, I'm yeah, so yeah. good. I'm, I'm, I'm so great at this game, I am the best. The most expert of gameplay. I am the most Sonic adventure -yest of Sonic Adventures. I am the Sonic Adventure. <laughs> Just walk up to a convention wearing nothing but blue paint and a sign that's saying, I am the Sonic Adventure. <laughs> Look forward to that much, Chuck. <laughs> And then you just pour hot chili all over yourself, and it's just like, Chili dogs! I am the Sonic Adventure! I am the Sonic Adventure! That's what I am! <laughs> you, you're running down the street going, I wanna fly high! We're just making all different flavors of mental breakdown, aren't we? <laughs> Look, it's all because of the action replay, okay? I put in a code, and it just made me lose my fucking mind, okay? That's, that's, all, that's all the codes, man! I'm gonna get a few more rings. I think that could be a range right here. There yes. you go, alright. Right there. How many did what, that what, give you? What, what, I, what happened? Did it even give me rings? Did it double your rings? I don't know what happened. Did it double how many you get? Did anything happen? Do I, what? 
Uh... That was probably the codes. Yeah, you clearly went into that area to start the slot machine, and then you jumped out. I'm gonna blame that on the codes. Yeah. It's not enough power! I wanna get up there, but I can't! It might also be the jump code, now that I think about it. Because, if you were to consider this in programming language, the jump might be the paddles. Like, that's causing you to jump. And it just doesn't know what to do because you're also colliding with oh, the side okay. of the machine. Maybe, but I got Shining K. K. Never had that kind of cereal before. Big money, big money. That's big money. That's enough. Oh, delicious rings with every bite. <laughs> Try new Sonic Ring. O's. Mm. Uh, delicious ring. Yeah. That's like the Mario cereal I had, you know, the, the cereal box that was also an amiibo. Yeah. Uh, it was basically just Lucky Charms. And that's it. Lucky Charms mixed with Fruit Loops. Lucky Charms kicks ass. Yeah, it was the... You think you're better than Lucky Charms? I never said that. I'm just saying. Well, because you, you are better than Lucky Charms. If, if you thought you missed out on something, it was Fruit Loops mixed with Lucky Charms. No, it was Tricks. Specifically Tricks. That was it. The taste of trick cereal. You just lost all your money. I don't know you? what happened. Nothing happened. Nothing happened, and then you just went through the flipper. Awesome. I think that might be enough. 228 plus 174. Yep, that's 400. Ish. Can I have all your money, sir? Thank you. That's enough. There we go. Ridiculous. You know, this is about how much time I spend in an actual casino, yeah, and then I need to bad. leave because I remember I have a gambling problem. Just can't do it. I mean, try to pull the lever and just... I push instead of pull, you know? And then they tell me to leave because I'm too inept to join into a casino. And then I walk outside covered in blue paint going, I want to fly. <laughs> I spent 12 and a half minutes getting that Chaos Emerald. It would really yeah. suck if some egg-shaped guy just took it from me. Well, oh no, the life is unfair. Emerald. This is what happens when you don't have any pockets or don't wear pants. Oh, and then he... And then he crop-dusted me? What the hell? Oh, at least Amy has the good sense to wear a dress. I think because we would violate some codes in different countries if she did not wear a dress. Sally Acorn never wore a dress. She just wore a vest, that was it. She did wear boots, too. Oh, Alright, who's the weirdo that decided, yeah, that okay, we draw the line at Amy, she needs to wear a dress. Uh, Maybe it was just I to denote Eggman that she was the cute the girl one, see, one, but then the pink might have given a, a big hint. That means his God, I'm really glad they gave Amy some fucking character in later good. games, though. Thank you. On, We're at a sort of stage where she's just a big Sonic fan, that's it. Oh, look! DX exclusive! That was Cream! That's Cream! That's Cream! Cream! What? What? Cream! There she is! Oh. Ah. She looks like a vulture in the distance, but now we know this is Cream! It was it was just a cameo, but there she is! Nice! Did that just blow your mind when you played it the first time, just going, oh my god. It was neat, because uh, she was just introduced to the cast around the time. When was she introduced? The Rush? It was Advance 2. Advance 2? Rush was Blaze the Cat. That's right. And then everybody's favorite character, Silver, showed up in 06. Yeah. Yeah. I forgot something. The, the uh, key the that... fucking uh, ice key. That, that slowly f came down from heaven. It's just like, here you go. I was so pissed because I got my Chaos Emerald stolen. That's understandable. I mean, I hate it when my Chaos Emeralds are stolen. The train headed for the it happens to way too often. Whoa, whoa, camera. Whoa, camera, hey now. Oh, there we yeah, go. All right. Snap to attack! At least with these, uh, lesser action replay codes, the camera still cannot keep up. Which is still very funny to me. It's too damn fast. Also worth mentioning, when we are in this carrying thing mode, turbo works, jump doesn't. That makes sense. Animations are probably different. Values are probably changed. See, no jump. No big super sexy jump. Because I'm weighed down with the with the weight of my sins. <laughs> the weight of the world. <laughs> and the ice key, of course. Might just be the ice key. Because Sonic has no sins. Okay, I want you to go through your encyclopedic knowledge of Sonic. Okay. need you to burrow down into that gray matter of yours. Mm. And I want you 
just to remember if it ever happened was there ever an ad for a sonic game where they said he was too damn fast you're asking about advertising and that's a different uh sec subsection okay I'm that's not fair. familiar with that's so. fair that's fair now it, it, it sounds like something they do but i do remember uh an ad for nintendo's n sports for the 64 it was a promo video that uh that uh, one of my uncles had and uh, the slogan was it just damn hurts okay it does you better not play then. Yeah, I don't want to play that. I'm not going to play Ken Griffey Jr.'s baseball. No way. It hurts. Yeah, it hurts. It, it just, it, 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 it damn hurts. Oh, man. They said the D word. So, invis invisible walls don't really apply so much here. We've no. got full rain now. Yeah, we're out of here. Yep. Into orbit. There we go. And here, up it's we basically go. just do a thing, trigger a flag, open a door, and we're good to go. You almost made it to the second checkpoint. I love this. I, I, I know, I know. There we go, there we go. Whoa, 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 hey, whoa, 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 there. Okay, okay. Use the panel to jump. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Takes us here, then all those fall. I want, makes that. I want to imagine every time you jump off of something and you're going so damn fast that you're just like, everything's okay, everything's okay, nobody panic, we got it, we got it. And now for the grand finale. Oh, right, this part. Snowboarding time. Go fast. Turbo. Yep, that's turbo. Man, that avalanche is fast! It, it wants you so bad! I've never seen an avalanche rubber band before! <laughs> Jeez! I want you, I want Woo! you, I want you, I want you, I want you! Worth mentioning that jump does not work. Again, different animations and all that. It might have the same values as carrying something. But turbo still works! Oh, does it! God, I hope an avalanche still isn't following me. Well, I really, that would really well, I really hope that the... That the, uh, the I guess, corridors of this, uh, stage board. Oh, right? shit. Oh, no. uh, hey, okay. This is a familiar sight in the action replay series. Whoa. Uh, it's, 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 uh, Sonic or one of his friends <laughs> falling into oblivion. But hey, he never looked this cool before out in the, out in the big white void. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Wait. There's the skybox. Can we, can we do it? Wait a minute. Really? Uh, are, are we going? Oh. oh, man. They were close. All right, go again. Yeah, rubber band. Yeah. <laughs> I got him, I got him, I got him. Whoa! <laughs> Never doing that again. <laughs> How did I land perfectly on that bridge? Wow. That was awesome. <laughs> All right, got, is it still following you or did it just give up? I, I think it's given up. Okay. The, the, oh, it's, it's a new challenge now, you see. Ooh, okay, okay. I was just thinking, I'm not going over there. There's ice down there. <laughs> it's cold over there. It's cold. <laughs> All right, still good, still good, whoa, still whoa, making it, whoa, still whoa, making it, whoa, still making whoa, it. Whoa. Whoa. Did a sick twist, I saw that. And... You ever heard of 1080 snowboarding? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is like a... This is a 9,000 snowboarding. 12,000 for yeah, a yeah, exactly. undefined yeah. integer. Up, 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 do I? What the hell? Oh, man. Wait, I, th I wait. thought you went through the world. Wait, no, I don't... I think I'm just stuck on a wall, because... Sonic's still kind of moving forward. Just, 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 I, I just, just jiggle it a little bit. Yeah, I, I think I gotta jiggle. I can still move them. Press those wait, GameCube wait, buttons. Wait, wait. Uh, 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 there we go. All right, yeah, all right, back at it. Woo! All right, yeah. now, where, where's that avalanche? We got some oh, shots there. What? Whoa! Still good? Still good? Yeah! This is the kind of Sonic game I need. Holy shit! Forget that Connect game where you're so extreme. Hell yeah! Free Riders, I think. Freebird, whatever it was called. Free Riders. It had a falcon in it. I don't know. It was it was Babylon or something. Woo! His name was Babylon. No, no it, it, like it was part of the group. Oh, it was uh, Jet Wave and Swallow. It, hmm. It's a big gray one too. No one, no one remembers it. It's just, just Jet and Wave, really. Jet, the most awesome of names. And you made it. I can't believe it. All right, what's the town have to say about this? Oh, no dice. It's kind of cool. I didn't notice there was a town back there before. Look at that. It, it just there's no reason for that to be there. Just, another, just for just for just for window decoration. Another DX lovely. exclusive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not bad. Yeah, not bad. Agreed, Sonic. That was in fact not bad. All right, I could stop here, but but I think I want to talk to our friend Knuckles. He never chuckles. Ooh, and he always focuses okay. his muscles. He's hard as nails, it ain't hard to tell. He breaks them down whether he's solid or frail. Unlike the rest of Independence's his first breath. The train headed for Station yeah. Square. It almost sounds like you're citing an incantation. <laughs> like you're trying to summon Knuckles. 
<laughs> Born on an island in the heavens, the blood of his ancestors flows inside him. His duty is to save the flower from evil yes. deterioration. Arise! <laughs> there he is! What's up, knucklehead? Flat-headed freak! Something bugging you? No time for games, Sonic! Give me the emeralds you have, right now! What? Let's just see you take it! Glad to some of them evil spirits that's in you! Do not stand up to- oh, Alright, uh, Knuckles fight! You're outmatched, buddy! He can still track you, which is funny. Like, he's trying. Well, he can track my X position, no problem. But my Y? Well... Uh -huh. See, this is when he yells into the, into the sky. Why? Oh, no. Woo! And then I come down like a hawk and just... Dive bomb! Is that... Oh, no. Give it your this is... Oh, no. One more to go. The internet was a weird place nine years ago, but hearing the oh no here now, it's even more relevant. Oh no. Ha! That will not be the last time we hear oh no. Yes! Tails gets a turn two. Uh, oh. Oh, no. Again, no the pockets. You ever been punched so hard that two gigantic diamonds fly out of your body? Last time I had kidney stones. I know. Yes. Were, were, were they that big? They just squeezed me and it just fired out like gunfire. Ooh! Hurt like a bastard. Just thinking unpleasant thoughts as to how it came out. Just, 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 like a pop gun. <laughs> Best part is, when I take a pee, I take all of the pee. It just all falls out. See, it used to be like, you know, uh, pouring a Capri Sun out of a straw, but now it's just like a water bottle. <laughs> <laughs> me? What about you? They call me Pop you Gun Pisser. <laughs> I hate this conversation. Now fight Eggman! I hate this fight. This fight stinks. Chaos. It's the dumbest fight in the game. Oh, this is Frog Chaos, isn't it? It's Chaos 4. Chaos 4 sucks. Chaos for Rog! Because all you gotta do is just wait. Chaos 4 is a waiting game. It's wait. All you do is wait. Jump around and wait. Wait for, wait for him to show up and be like, Huh? Are you ready to take damage now? Are you ready for me to take damage now? And then you hit him. You do it like... Too many goddamn times. You do... And you do this fight three times. Uh, I hate Chaos 4. I hate Chaos 4. I hate Chaos 4. I love Sonic Adventure. I hate Chaos 4. You know, if this was modern Sonic, he would have jumped and grabbed those emeralds out of the sky before Chaos had a chance to eat them all. Just saying. If this was modern Sonic, it would be just like I didn't add any codes at all. Oh, he, he, he broke out the lift. Oh no, oh yes. shit. It's now officially Sonic yes. fandom time. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes, indeed. Alright, so while we're waiting, we have plenty of time to just explore the skybox. Look how beautiful it is. Jump too far, otherwise you'll fall out. I wonder what painting that's from. Did you think about that? Could be some asset. Could be, yeah. It's a nice wrap around this arena. I noticed they also took the time to give it sand. Which means players might have just tried to jump out of that little area there and see the sand, maybe? I, th I think it's just window dressing. Possibly. I mean, this place looks like uh, where a Metal Gear Solid 3 boss would take place. No! That's what you meant. Yes. Oh. See, my thought is that the more in the water you are, the more chaos is aggressive. But the more out of the water you are, i.e. on the lily pads and playing the game correctly, that's when he'll... maybe that would uh, force his, huh, you're gonna hit me? Which seems to last forever. Okay. I also noticed you're just walking on water, so something must have broken. It's it, it's how the stage is. He's allowed to swim, but it's it's ankle deep water for you. It's ankle deep. What? Yeah, it's weird. This is like a pond. No, it's weird. I mean, awesome that you can just run around on water. I guess. This is totally how the fight should have gone. By the way, you jumping into the stratosphere and just dropping down. But he goes, where did you go? You have a very uh, bird versus fish type appeal, you know? I am. Have Tails get his tornado! His lab's right down there! There and just we go! Just dive bomb the motherfucker! Yes! That's how you fix this! 
or at the very least, have it so that the three of them fight differently, you know? Yeah, having to do the exact same fight three times is a little weak sauce, but... I'm gonna call that just, you know, it's a tech demo type deal because they never <laughs> do that problem again for Sonic Adventure 2. Because you fight the Golem boss twice already, but the way you fight him is different. Because you're fighting a Sonic who does, you know, running around yeah. and all that, and then you fight his Eggman who does the shooting and the lock on and all that. Yeah, changing up the fight a little bit, depending on the character, would have been interesting. But it is just the same fight three times! I hate it! It makes me cry! A small blemish for what is a 10 out of 10 in most Sonic fans' eyes. No, it's not. What would you rate it? 10 out of 10. Oh, yeah, there we go. That's because I have a lot of nostalgia for it, but uh, this isn't exactly one of the darling ones in a lot of people's eyes. What? What do you mean? When people say 3D Sonic games were never good. Ooh, it's this they, one. They, they, they call this his uh, kicking and screaming transition uh, to 3D. I'm like, really? You guys have no taste. Yeah, Sonic's holding you underneath the water. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All your games are great, I'm sorry. Call in the Egg Fleet. Sonic drowned another gamer. Subtlety is Eggman's top priority. It's what he prides himself in, honestly. How does he build this stuff, though? You know, I always thought the same thing with Dr. Wily. Does he make one robot to help him make two robots to help him make four to continue the assembly line? The process has to be all automated, all automa because as we'll see in the Egg Carrier, he has an automated janitorial staff. But in order to get there, he would have to make one after another after another and then just keep that process going. I mean, he, he strikes me as an efficient kind of guy. He has, would, he has an IQ of 300. I would say the first thing he would make is an assembly line to keep the process going. So sure. I totally agree. Yeah. Oh man, he probably didn't even need to make the first bot. Just make the assembly line. Make sure it works. One robot in, and then just crank that sucker up. We need some Eggman revisionism up in here. I need the egg lore. He needs to have his redemption arc. I think that's kind of what the Sonic Boom cartoon did. Because he wasn't... He was more of a comic foil than an actual villain. That's a different timeline. I'm talking about this one, though. I mean, he took over the world in Chronicles! Hey, and he, 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 he kept it! Yeah, that's it. Just get game over. Because they got bought by EA, and I guess it's back to Mass Effect 3 and bad Mass Effect games in Dragon Age forever. You know what? I have the Mass Effect collection on Xbox, and I went through my Xbox One games and found another Mass Effect game and thought that was the collection. No, it's Andromeda! Oh, dear. Oops! Oh, dear. Bought that for five bucks. Well, I'm just kind of running around now and... Trying to break things? Just, just trying to break stuff now. Hell that's yeah. about all I got. Trying to avoid Tails' workshop so we don't advance the, the, the oop, plot oop. line. But next time on Sonic Adventure Director's Cut Action Replay. Sads are. Sads are. We're gonna be heading deeper into Sonic's story. Then taking to the skies. Maybe we can find some codes that can do some fun stuff there. See you next time!